Okay, let's start it right now. Here's the play. Tack McCann, look at him. Two blocks, then boom. Hits the quarterback, brings him down. This game, he had two sacks. We're going to go through it. The play twice, he does his little dance. But this is Tack McKinley's sacks. You see him right here, number 98, now the full hand down. Look at him kind of cheating over. Gets rid of the receiver, gets rid of the blocker. Boom, jumps on the quarterback. He sees the mismatch, and he makes it happen. That's what I like about Tack McKinley. He does his little dance. We're going through Tack McKinley's sacks. Here, still against Carolina. I told you, this is third and long. Carolina in field goal range. Puts McCaffrey out as a receiver. You know how good and dynamic he is. Look at the rush. Stuffs things up. Great play by Tacky. Look at him. Does a little dance. Maybe thinks it's a fumble on the play, but it wasn't. Here we go again. Opposite side of him is Vic Bees. We know they hated on him. Gun. Five wide receiver set. Tack putting his hand down this time. Beat 72. Nice outside. Gets rid of him and then makes the sack happen. Beautiful play. He was down, though. The quarterback wasn't a fumble. Take a look. Week 11, Tack McKinley. Right here, top of the screen. Standing up. Nice. Gets rid of the guy. One-on-ones. This is what Tack can do. He just needs to be more consistent. Sometimes I like him so far in this film study with his hand not down. Look at that. Nice rush. Nice bull rush. Gets to the quarterback. Had a great time against Carolina. Three sacks in two games. Let's go to the Colts now. Shotgun formation. You see, you notice this shotgun, third and long situations, obvious passing situations. Tack is good at this. Look, nice bull rush all the way into Jacoby Brissett. Him and his teammate, Vic Beasley, with the sack. Here we go again. Hand up, standing up. Obvious passing situation. Vic, Tack Reason, nice bull rush. Right into the quarterback. Vic Beasley there to clean up the mess as well, too. Here we go against Tampa Bay. What is the reoccurring theme? Third down, obvious situation. Looks like they want to bring blitzers. He has his hand in the ground this time. Vic Beasley standing up. Look at him. Just uses his speed, gets to the outside, doesn't give up on the play. Makes the sack happen. Take a closer look at this. Hand in the ground. Jameis Winston, the quarterback. Steps up. Can't see anything. Tack McKinley jumps on his back. Makes the play happen. Back to Carolina. This time, this is Cam Newton. This is 2018. Empty set. It's, it, he just gets beat. He just gets beat on this play. Up, oh, this isn't Cam. Excuse me, this is not Cam Newton. But look at the play, anyways. Look at Tack. Look at the play he makes. He gets the half a sack. Just, just bullies, bullies the offensive lineman here against the Giants. I believe this was Monday Night Football. Obvious passing situation. Eli out of the gun. Falcons bring an extra rusher from the secondary. Tack. Looks like he runs a little stunt play. Let's look at it again. Here he goes. See, confusing the line, putting all these guys up front. Tack McKinley. No, it was just a beating his guy on the outside. I can see how the Giants could be confused. I would love to see the Falcons do this more next season. Kind of confuse people with these, with these blitz packages. These zone blitzes that they got schemed up. Here we go again. Tack McKinley kind of bull rushes the left tackle into the quarterback, Andy Dalton. Here we go. He's playing defensive tackle. I like to see him there use his speed, using his strength. Andy Dalton doesn't have a chance. Here again, close game, 28-27 to against the Bengals. Shotgun formation. Tack has been doing pretty well on the inside. This Falcons defensive line overall was pretty good. Vic even active on this. The pocket just collapsed. There he goes, this time at the defensive emphasis. Look at him, just bull rush, bullying his way into the quarterback. 
had a heck of a game. Thirty three twenty eight. Same game. Attack McKinley. Bullies just bullies that left tackle into the quarterback. Reoccurring theme. Easy play. There you go. Celebrating with his homeboys. Andy Dalton looks like he's down. Somebody's down over there. Here we go. Top of the screen. He could play defensive tackle. He could play DN. Boom. Bull rush. Get rid of him. Gets to Dalton. Makes the play happen. If it's a fumble, Vic Beasley. Yep, fumble, Vic Beasley on the recovery. Shotgun formation at home. Standard four line set. No zone blitz. Tack McKinley doesn't give up on the play, and he makes it happen right there. Boom. Does a little. He loves dancing. Look at that. Oh. Oh, oh. Here against Cam Newton. Look like a little zone play action pass read. Bang. Tack McKinley gets to the quarterback. Here against the Eagles first quarter, third and long. On the road. This was week one, a couple years back. Tack McKinley standing up. Left defensive end position. Nick Foles fumbles it. That really caused the sack. But hey, Tack McKinley was there. Makes the play happen. Here we go. A lot of guys on the line of scrimmage. You don't you, you, who's coming, who's not. Tack McKinley, boom. Makes the play happen. Third and seven. Still first quarter. Three wide receivers to the right, one to the left. Shotgun formation, Nick Foles. Here, right here, there's Tack. Nice play. Aims at the legs. Makes the play happen. I think he's hurt on the play as well, too. Standing up, leaning over, gets that forward lean. Nice, just, just, just bull rushes the tackle. Now here we go. Nice little rush. It's like a semi bull rush, and then boom, he uses that swim swimming and let, let lets him lets that tackle go. Like look at the beginning of this. Here we go. It's that bull rush. That bang gets to the quarterback, knocks him down. Nice play on Jared Golf. You know what you gotta do at the end. A little dance. Show a little love. Get down tonight. Back in Tampa Bay. Tech with Kelly. Boom, doesn't give up on the play. Fumble. Bucks recover. Right here, I like that. I like it. Stays low. Look at that. Leaning. Doesn't give up on the play. Gets outside leverage. Boom, causes the fumble. Nice force fumble by Tack McKinley. Third and three. This time hand in the ground. Obvious passing situation for Minnesota. Gets outside leverage. Makes the play happen. Big time sack by Tack. Big time sack on Kirk Cousins. One more time. There he goes right here. He beat 71. This is easy work. Outside, outside, outside. Boom. Gets outside leverage. Nice play. Here we go. Five wide receiver set here against Tampa Bay. Tack McKinley right there. Stands the guy up. He's doing push-ups. Uh, uh. Tack McKinley, excuse me, right here. Working against 69. Gets outside. Never even really touched. Doesn't even really make contact. Nice, nice sack. Second and 13, shotgun formation. Tack McKinley is lined up right here. Top of the screen. 
Barely makes contact. I like that. Against Russell Wilson, too hard to bring down. Makes initial contact. Nice play. Here we go. Tack McKinley working 65. Boom. Quick contact. He knows what Russell Wilson is all about. Loves to move around. Creates the fumble, which equals a touchdown for the Falcons. Here against the Cowboys. Down 7-3. Dak Prescott in the shotgun formation. Look at him working this tackle. Never giving up on the play. And then he recovers the fumble. Nice play by Tack McKinley being aware. Recovering the fumble on the play. Here we go getting a forward lean on 71. Teammate makes the play. He jumps on the ball. 